Hey guys, it's Harminder here, um, thanks for coming back to me yesterday, very kind of you on your weekend as well. Um, I, I love the idea you're talking about, I didn't think about getting individual hotels or restaurants or leisure activity places in the actual resort to be as part of Pixum, I just thought, just use the travel agents, but yeah, that opens up a whole new genre of industry for us um as well as travel agents hotels restaurants that are within that area so yeah fantastic that we've that you thought that thought that i want to expand to that um genre of people okay going back to your question about functionality um because was not quite at the tagging stage yet but um i have an idea for you um so for example we went back to the albums and we will go to we'll go for second of April. Let's add in. We've, we've chosen the hotel we're, we're going to, and we want to start to now look at some of the features it's offering. So okay, so let's go to this hotel. I'll, I'll type in Atlantis. Oh, I know which hotel I'm talking about. Let's create that. Let's upload the hotel that we've seen. And we like now at this point here i will start to utilize the comments box so at this point here i would just go copy paste and add comment and upload now you're talking about where do we see that link for that hotel or where was it and at a glance you can see that it's there I mean the only issue I think you're gonna have is you won't be able to copy that uh, sorry link on that from there you have to copy that path and then put it in for some reason it's running twice I'll, I'll check that out but yeah I don't, you'd have to copy and paste it but I can look at HTML functionality on that and see if it, it can insert it in as a as a linkable path but yeah i mean even then you've got the share option you can then email it to yourself the twitter and facebook at 40 at the moment just launches your twitter home page um it doesn't insert in because it doesn't know what to grab but again you know you can put a way to make it probably make that more streamlined it's probably just a little bit of coding there but as far as your question is concerned, I think I've kind of answered it with, you know, this is a hotel we stayed at, you know, and add comments in. Um, you have the share option there. To, I mean, if you wanted to, you could email it to yourself. And then even the email functionality gives you the option there to see the path of Pixuma and what you're talking about. And you can insert that into, for the, for the moment, into any platform you want to i mean like even like with tiktok now these days you've got people are on facebook and on whatsapp or on twitter and then they are sharing videos from tiktok so pixima could be the same thing you're on different platforms you can then insert once it's in your social media platform then you can tag and add and share and do what you want it's just having that option just to move it across i mean that's what people do you know they, they move across different platforms and i don't think Pixuma at the moment needs to have that functionality um but even within the well, i'm thinking here something even within the actual website some of those functions are not available it's quite basic and those kind of features cost a lot of money to do that and, you know, my developer said if you want if you're on Facebook, you know, you need to give me an open checkbook because you know it's not going to be cheap to do that right in your own platform. This is out of a box platform, so it's giving you certain functionality. But I think there's enough there for us to play with without getting over complicated because people just don't want complicated um, at the moment. So if we give them a, a simple platform they can use, but I wanted to show you something else very quickly when you're adding in multiple pictures i mean there's something called favorites as well if you actually favorites you can then start to look at what are your favorite pictures on different albums 
and then you can start to flick through the pictures. I just want to show you how this worked. It's a it's a proper album, so you can if you have more than one picture in your album, you can then flick through quite easily and add comments in and share. Um, I hope that's helpful. And as far as I'm concerned, because they 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 be my developers have developed this to the point of the out of box functionality and adding the albums feature. There's not much more to it than that really. Apart from adding your friends, you can do messages within Pixuma, so you can send your friend a message. But why would you do it if you can just if you can just then just like a picture as my daughters have done here somewhere down the bottom? Um, I'll show you. Quite a lot going on here, isn't there? Yes, yeah, so I got one like Barker in there. Um, but yeah, I mean, like I said, the, the options are there. You can then add a comment into your activity feed as well. So if you want to discuss the Alan say, oh, Daddy, we'd love to go here, or Mum, we'd love to go here, you can add a comment in there. You can hit the star button, which then adds it to your favourites. So you can then start to also use that as a functionality with the customers or with your family or whoever's whoever you're protecting this to to say okay you can now start to build your profile of what your favorites are you can add it into your own albums or you can share albums and there's there's a couple of things that are quite basic that you, if you put your mind to it they can use it to your own advantage and see how you want to use it um, but yeah the albums are very very basic you can just stick a comment in there and again, you know, it becomes that like, almost like a diary. But you know, you've got, got, you've got the the whole purpose of Pixuma is, is the picture shows you everything you need to know. But hey, there's the option of adding in anything you want underneath it as a note, so you, you don't forget. I mean, it's difficult to incorporate it into the picture itself because it's, it's a still image. Um, Pixuma does have video. So, at some point, I'll activate that option. The only reason I haven't done it at the moment is purely because of space. Um, it could rapidly fill up the server space, but that's something I'm working on at the moment. But the, but the functionality is there. So you could upload a picture, a video of yourself saying, blah, 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 we're going here, we're going there, this is the web address, upload Pixuma. So, play back your video. You know, again, you're driving in your car, you want to go somewhere, you want to find a place, hit the Pixuma. You can just listen to a video. I mean, a lot of people now on WhatsApp, but I mean, I'm doing that quite a lot now. I don't bother texting no more. So I'll just hit the microphone button. I'll send I'll send a colleague a message or a friend a message via via the microphone recorded. Um, just quicker. You can say a lot more within 30 seconds than trying to type that. And pick Zoom, it could be the video version of of, of messages. Like, yeah, but like what well, Zoom does, but it's just a more of a smaller version of, of notes so you know record yourself a little video upload it to remind yourself so that okay so there you go that's kind of where i'm at with this there's not a whole load to it and i wanted to keep it that way from the beginning because i wanted it to be quite simple but also like i said to you when you log onto the site the albums will be the default home page and not the activity feed which it currently is so it doesn't confuse people to say, oh, I'm second, this looks, looks like a social media site and not a photo diary site. Um, but like I said, as soon as we organise the homepage, which has been done, this will be a part of that. And as I said, um, thanks for your, um, your feedback yesterday. Some great ideas there. I suppose all I need from you now is, how do we start this process? Um, yeah, I, I can identify you know, half a dozen, maybe three travel agents, but three hotels that we could start to target with this. And it comes back to the question of, this is what I was trying to say, trying to make you understand, which I didn't do very well first time around, was the video I did initially was explaining how Pixel worked. And I think you got it when I, sh when I did it for the video. But unfortunately, it comes across very amateurish when we 
when I do it with my PC and talking through it, you know, it's not what you get on YouTube, the, you know, the, the people there with the nice office and the backdrops and the nice cameras and they're, you know, all dressed up and dolled up and doing their videos. But that's something that you can think about how we want to portray that image across and if it works that way. Um, yeah, let me know your thoughts. If there's any other questions, please check them through to me. Thanks. Bye-bye.